Well, I've cut the grass. The fig tree buds are popping out. I edged all around everything, got it all pretty. Edged around the front, the front grass don't need cutting. This is mostly weeds, like I told you yesterday. It's one o'clock. The tide's low in about an hour and a half or so. I'm headed to I'm headed to the land of Nada today. Well, no parking spots here. Let's try one block south. We're going to the button patch, the land of Nada. I think we're in luck. We got two. Okay, dokie. I'll get back to you. There's been a couple of buttons found lately. One in this general area, a British Navy button, anchor button, I guess you call it, and another one to the south. Now, the gig was down here yesterday, not here. I think he was by the pier some way. He found a he found a silver ring, 925er, and a bunch of a few other things. It's, it's really rough as bricks and windy, so I'll get back to you. I don't know what it is, but it's a decent sound. Kind of kind of uh, solid, but it jumps around a lot. From three to ten. That could be a nice old ball cap hiding. Well we got it. Two and four out of the sand. Looks like a piece of junky ass wire to me. Oh, it's a piece of crappy aluminum. Ah, there you go, Sapphire. Right here, in those condominiums, that used to be the YWCA. They had this area right out here roped in for swimming. And here's the pier. You can see they did away with almost all the pier, except for this little short piece right here. I don't know if they're going to leave that and make a thing for the people to walk out on and enjoy themselves or what, but we'll see. Looks like it's really steep here. Holy Thalia. I need a side hill clincher just to get down the beach. You know what a side hill clincher is, right? That's a mountain goat with two legs shorter on one side and the other, so we can go around the mountain faster. A side hill clincher. That's right. I made it. Might be some gray matter here today. I always find some gray matter here. Let's give it a spin.
solid seven. As I said, Junko. I mean, penny. That's too deep for a penny. I don't know how many scoops it was, but it was a lot of scoops. Well, this spot right here looks pretty interesting. If it wasn't so rough, maybe the first calm day I'll come back here and see it's a nice little drop off right there. Up from there to the pier, that little slew right through there. I like it. See how deep it is? Nice. A nine to a twelve. It's a little jumpy though. Sixteen out of sand. Looks like a big chunk of aluminum. Yes, sir. That's a fine ticket right there. I did dig this up. It was a fourteen. To the telltale tail. You probably can't see it, but right there is a little piece of monofilament sticking out of the sand. Just waiting for me to grab it. Some gray matter on the other end of it. Uh oh, there's the tag. But I guess the gray matter broke off. That means we have to dig it up. Come out of there, Gray Matter. I didn't expect it to be in China. Great Goga Mooga. Maybe I missed it a little bit. I can't believe it. Everything I 
dug it in, it's been deep. Got it. 13. A little teeny thing. How did it get so deep? Look at that baby gray matter. Sound like the Empire State Building. Well, I guess I'm going dirt digging tomorrow. And that's the best of it. You got to go a different direction. One dime. Three pennies. Unbelievable. See you tomorrow.